Hello and welcome to my channel where we make structural engineering design simple and easy. I want to say big thank you to everyone who has subscribed to our channel and everyone sending encouraging words to us. We appreciate you. So we, we got a lot of questions this week. We have um, a subscriber come Konwani Mandi, you say great work engineer greetings from Zambia we appreciate you sir we really really appreciate that we have another Mahamat Abaka um, Abaka you didn't tell us where you are uh, commenting from but you said thank you so much we appreciate you okay Mahamat Abaka said i have a problem with installation of protas t i cannot open it how can i solve it i'm from chad oh abaka we appreciate that i think what we will do next is to put up a video on how to install prota structure i think we'll be having a lot of question about that so but if you have in your area where where they install anywhere they sell software you can you can meet them and they will assist you but hopefully a subsequent video i think we will have to show how to install proto structure we we do that please um abaka just pay attention to this page we will do that soon 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 once we have a bit of time in our hand because right now we are really really choked with a lot of work but once we are a bit um, relaxed we will put up a video on how to install prota structure we we do that thank you very much we have another subscriber ezekiel akimbody akimbody you didn't tell us where you are com you are committed from you said thank you so much for the tutorial i pray almighty god will strengthen you and make you become more successful in all ramification in jesus name amen to that please how can i download the title block template you uploaded sir i said uh, we've been saying this i think uh, if you check properly is in the description of the video that i made that comment go to the description you will see it and check our videos we've been we'll be constantly uploading we've been putting the links in the description uh, in the description um, bar so go there you see the link click and when they ask for access i will grant you access thank you very much and um, we have another subscriber, Gozola, Gozolo, Rakwachi Balo. You didn't tell us where you are commenting from. You say, please, sir, how may I get the Excel spreadsheet? Is it possible? I think that sheet should be online. Please just um, browse about um, uh, re uh, your reinforced concrete Excel sheets. It should be online, but let me know let me know if you've tried it please tell us where you are committed from you didn't tell us that let's know that and we have them um, tuesday morimi tuesday morimi you said hi tuesday from kenya hey greetings from kenya we appreciate you you say thanks for your tutorial and as um assuming when prota designs the column or any frame or any frame column design by any software or even manually movement from beams at column intercepts are taken into account when you are designing with the spreadsheet you only transfer and only and use using as their load only aren't you supposed to include movements in your spreadsheet design Tuesday, we appreciate you for that. So, what it is there, but most time the the column moments are very minor. 
are very minor. In a case where your colon moment is is heavy, then there is going to be a separate um, design. Majorly, when you get such heavy moments, are uh, when your columns are cantilevered or when there is no support up. If the columns are not fixed up at the top but once your beams are connecting to them it becomes a rigid structure when your columns are having a lot of movement then there is an issue an issue they have very minor um minor moments like this that will design i finished designing this okay let, let, let let's see something we'll go to colon and we'll say um reports we'll go to the reports let's see the moment that this um our design we we give to us let's see the 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 moment that the design okay good now it has finished the design and see our moments point point nine and seven point six point nine and seven point six so if let's assume we've done a design and we'll put even ten at this and we'll say we put five no we we'll say five Five at this it still gives us four y twelve four y twelve so most time the moments are small very small that's why um empirically if you if you are doing it's an assume you assume that the the major force on that column is the Asia load but when your column the the your columns are having heavy moments heavy moments then two ways you can solve for that is to either break the span of your beams break the span of your beams to limit the span but majorly we design columns to take majorly the asia as your loads but any moment that that comes in due to eccentricity and the rest may be minimal but when it becomes troublesome then you design to that but these are columns are just a single floor um duplex or single floor um, columns that shouldn't be an issue if you ignore the 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 moment on that because they are very small but when you are handling high rise where there's wind load on the the structure heavily then you must consider your moment it becomes very critical when you are designing slender columns or very high rise building then the effect of wind creating moments on those columns will be very prominent but right now the buildings we are designing the moments or winds cannot um, create heavy moments on them so even if you ignore it doesn't really make any change so that's a good observation you should put if you have it for most time is minimal it's just a minimal that you can do away with you can do away with thank you very much so today we are going to talk about um um ezekiel akimbode said he wants to snow he wants the title block so there's a way we can create title block in proto detail that is what i want to show us today uh, it will be a short video now if you finish your design the modeling analysis and design please check our our previous videos how we do that please check that so come to um concrete design click on proto you say yes 
so give it some time when it comes up you we have okay so we have opened the protal data click on start by creating new new um, sheet if you want to create um, the floor plans you you click on the floor this is the first floor right click you see draw when you see draw a dialog box pops a dialog box pop most time you click on the form form plan side dimension if you want the site to be dimensioned you can click here show what oh, these are okay show numbers of buying label mm -hmm. then this is very important if you uncheck here your your uh, bill of um, schedule your bar schedule will not come up but if you click here you see your bar schedule if you click here the model information will not but if you want to input it in in um if you want to input it inside your title block and sheet you click on this it will generate it the scale is one is to 50 so you say draw once you say draw click on it give it some time to do that before you know it will bring out your your formwork your title block so you can easily fill in all your drawn by description the form and every other thing but if you if you already have that before you already have that you can you can either move it there then let's assume we want our floor our floor beam give enough space for it floor beam you click on it you say insert insert this is the game changer if you don't insert inside sheet then you can't get anything so if you look automatically it will do this for you so with this your work is already arranged you can even move this because this is the only one here you can even move this to this place click outside and this is what you have this is your bar schedule your bar schedule you can right click and move and move it to this click outside then you can do away with all oh, these are your columns the information all oh, these are the the bearing capacity normal information about your drawing so with this when you click on this you can say right click draw all insert and you say okay click it will automatically do that so with this your work can be arranged or you can do it normal if you already have your bar schedule your your title block like that um, file i i gave if you already have that then no need to do that but if to do this but if you don't you can even have your title block from here and start with then you can export double click on this change directory you can move it to desktop you say okay and you export you say you can export that is how you do it you can export and you have it here 
this is it so you can start playing or working with it quickly so maybe in our next video i can tell you how to arrange it properly but check some of our videos we've already done that these are different parts of the beams right center but this is the schedule this is the schedule for it so we will stop here for today if you have any question please send um, send it uh, post it on the comment and tell us where you are commenting from and we will be glad to answer you and if you are yet to subscribe please click the subscribe button share the videos if we are benefiting or if you have been benefiting from any of our any of our video please put it on the comment that yes you are enjoying and you are benefiting and tell us where you are commenting from so until we see remain blessed thanks